All right, guys, I'm going to show you a hydrogen generator I made with my Arduino, some salt water. Um, and my next step is maybe to power something. So what we have here is the um, dual motor controller. So this is a uh, L298N dual H-bit motor controller. You get it from eBay. I used a tutorial from Tronics Lab. Thank you, Tronics Lab. Um, let me flip over. This is actually the uh, Arduino code there. I copied it out. And this is running right now, but I don't have the switch on. I have a 12 volt battery powering the motor controller. I have the two motor leads coming out to two washers with a little plastic spacer and a binder clip to hold the to hold the wires on. Now you see there's no hydrogen coming out of that right now. But if I flip this switch, we should get some decent hydrogen out of there. I'll take you guys through the code in a second. So I'll take you through the code, but it's producing a good bit of hydrogen. I'm going to turn this off. Um, I have the code out here in Notepad so I can share it to you. You might slow it down, stop the video if you need to do it, but the, the lab's pretty straightforward. The Tronic Labs tutorial. There's plenty of tutorials. I changed it. I didn't use all their code. I had some other code. But um, essentially, I'm setting the pins for the motor controller, like the enable A, the enable B, and the pins, and they're all over here. I'm not going to bring you through that whole lab. There's plenty of labs, but those wires coming up to the Arduino that's all them all the pins you can wire them up separately um, I set the pulse width to be 255 which I think is the max works good that way of course this is all the setup I have the LEDs blinking a little bit and serial so I can see what's going on I set all the motor pins and the setup void and then in the loop, I'm gonna I just print a loop out. Turn for every other loop, I'm turning the LEDs on and off. That's these LEDs, one and zeros. And I'm spinning the motor forward and back. So I made my own little functions for spinning the motor forward. So when a motor goes forward. Um, it sets the pulse width, uh, sets the pins high and low, and if it goes reverse, it does the reverse. So it just swaps the high and low for the uh, pin 1, pin 2 on the motor controller. Um, so as this loops around, I'm actually reversing the polarity of the two washers. So that way one washer... Um, one side will produce hydrogen, the other will produce oxygen as it splits the oxygen and hydrogen modules, uh, molecules in water. And I added salt water, you want some salt water so it has a catalyst, the electricity will flow faster. And I even have soap in there so bubbles so I can actually see what it produces. Um, as I put that back in right now, it's producing nothing. But again, we turn this switch on. We're going to get some serious hydrogen production out of it. And if you guys do enough subscribes, I will post the code for that and share it. So subscribe, tell a friend, and I will post the code. Thanks for watching. Post sure, send me a link.